Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how you can texture parts of your objects similar to these four objects that you, that you see in front of us. I'm going to use this object as an example and I'm in the material preview mode right now. To do so, under UV editing, something that I recommend is to have your image loaded up already. And so, so at the top here, where it says Browse Image to be Linked, um, if you have a load already, you would select that, or if not, you would click this other button, where you would, it would navigate to your, through your directory to pick an image that they, they want to load. For this model here, our goal is to texture this top face here. Let's go to Top View. Let's go to face select, select these faces here, and if you want to select more, you can hit the control plus. I think this much is enough for demonstration purposes. Then you will hit U, unwrap. Well, it's true that you can do a predict review, I just find that you be unwrapping the part that you care about is more reliable. Now, next step is let's add a new material. Let's sign it to this face that we just selected, and you see now that if we select it, you know that this blank material is applied to the faces that we were just at. I'm going to hit new, call it tile texture, just as a demonstration. And then we're going to go underneath our shading workspace. And so this is the texture that we're going to load onto, not load onto, but apply onto this face here. Under the shading tab, hit shift A image texture select the one that we want if we don't have an image preloaded already you you can you just have the option to open an image with the folder icon and you take the color and then you plug it to the base color I would do something a little extra just to match the roughness of uh, of, of the rest of, of this model, drops down to point 0.2. If you don't necessarily like the scale of this, uh, the easiest way is to select your image texture, control T, and this and you do need a node regular add-on enabled by going under edit preferences and turning on the add-on. Control T, UV is correct. Want to make the texture bigger? It, I believe you drop the scale over if you want more of it. All right, it's the other way around. Um, if you want to make your scale a little easier, you can plug a single value into the vector. And we'll hold Shift and then um, and move this around to our liking. In this case, one well, works just fine. So that's it. That's how you texture parts of a model. If you found it useful, drop a like. If you want to see something that's that uh, would have been more helpful, let me know in the comments. Thanks again for watching. See you next time.